Hello and welcome to Herman Hits the Road. I'm Ads. And I'm Zoe. And in this video, we're going to be taking a look at our top five space saving ideas. So, in collaboration with other vanners, and you'll see a playlist at the end of this video to go and see their videos, or you can go and have a look at the video description where there are links to their videos. Um, so, in our top five space saving ideas in a motorhome, in no particular order, we have shelving as our first one. Yes. Uh, shelves, uh, you may not know this but you can actually adjust the height and remove them entirely if you want to. Um, inside the shelf, at either side of the uh, shelf itself, there are holes and you can change the height by removing, uh, taking the clip out of the hole and then reposition it into a, a higher or lower one. Mm. And that allows you to uh, gain height in on one shelf. Or you can remove the shelf completely, couldn't That's you? That's right gain height in one shelf and then uh, put taller things in there or small things in the top shelf etc etc so you're not just stuck with a shelf at the at one height mm. and all the shelves can be at different heights throughout the throughout your motorhome or even caravan our next one I think is got to be don't take what you don't need or you don't think you will use, such as clothing, which you are which is, hinting at. Yes, that's right. We, we don't take a lot of clothing. No. <clears throat> we probably take three changes. For a two-week holiday, we take three changes of clothes. Well, and also, yeah. And then we, we wash it uh, in the middle of our holiday and towards the end of our holiday, probably mm. every every seven days, we, probably. We probably sound a bit minging, but <laughs> we don't change our trousers, say our walking trousers, every day. Because no. they're going to get mucky. We're going to get they? mucky. Um, the other thing you might not want Cuddling to take, for mud. instance, is, is an awning tent. Now, if you've got an awning tent, are you going to use it? Because we took our awning tent, very, uh, we had, used to have an awning tent, we took it everywhere with us, but we hardly used it. So, mm. you know, it's a waste of space, really. But then it's quite good if you've got a lot of, you know, your bikes you can put under it, or if it's cold, you can sit oh, under yeah, it. Oh, yeah, there's a reason for yeah. putting, you, you, using it. But, but whether you're... are you going to use... Yes. Whatever you take... Do you think you're actually going to use it? You never know, do you, with the no. weather and... Sounds an obvious one, but I don't think it is really. No. Because um, you always think you need it, don't you? Take it just in just case. Just in case. Well, those just in cases probably never happen. And another one is... Uh, don't take luggage bags with you. Now, again, it sounds an obvious one, mm. but if you're carting your luggage to your motorhome, maybe your motorhome or caravan is in storage somewhere mm. and you're cutting it from your house, uh, don't take the luggage, leave it in the car. Mm. And if you're renting, which is very difficult to do if you're renting because of course you may not have a vehicle to put it, put the luggage in. Uh, for instance, when we went to New Zealand, yes. we had, you know, we, we took whatever we were. So... <clears throat> collapsible but, bags. But yeah, so if you're renting, use collapsible or foldable uh, luggage bags mm. like a holdalls a next one would have to be stackable storage and uh, we have uh, the, so these aren't uh, foldable but they are uh, small crates which you can stack up and then because they can stack you're you're artificially making shelving yes. within your shelving with your cabinets so we have uh, we have mushroom crates which I found in a in a car park in Sainsbury's car park, I thought someone what, just left on the floor. No, they just left on the floor. I thought, well, let's take a few of those. They might come in handy, mm. and they did. And the mushroom crates, just stuck them on there. And we put all our knickknacks that we may not use very often, but we definitely like. Uh, need. And also because we've got the um, ski locker at the back, you've got the shelves there. But it's nice to have extra yeah, that's shelves, right, a bit isn't extra it? shelves within the yes. shelf. And of course, you can also get stackable. Uh, plastic shoe boxes. I think you can get them from supermarkets. Chaz and Liz use these. They put them in a shelf and they label them what's actually in there. And uh, keeping, That's a bit too... Um, keeping everything all nice and neat and tidy uh, and saving lots of space. So you want a kind of a, a stackable unit which is uniform and not going to use up too much space. Mm, okay. Mm. And then finally, uh, use... 
foldable or collapsible products. <laughs> We're using that word a lot, aren't it we? It is, but collapsible. I mean... Collapsible. Collapsible or foldable products. Simply because when you're not using it, it, it doesn't use up yes. as much space. Yeah. And we have a foldable, collapsible bucket. Uh, of course, your foldable chairs, that's a, that's a must. Uh, that's, that's an obvious one. Yes, because well, you it? wouldn't get those in the back, would uh, you? Foldable or collapsible barbecue. Yes. What else have we got? We've got um, a washing up bowl, which we've probably only used once or twice, haven't we? Because we always tend to well, do the washing up Well, maybe we should get here. rid of that then. Well, I like it because <laughs> if we've got really dirty, you know, if we you need to kind of clean really it dirty, well. Yeah. Yes, it's, it's easier at the um, shower block, isn't it? Rather than washing up in here, it's all greasy. Tables. Foldable or collapsible tables. Yes. So put use them rather than a full, you know, one with legs where you've got screwing or whatever you need to and do. And then that just goes at the back of the passenger seat, doesn't it? So that folds away very easily. What else do we have foldable? Pants. Foldable pants. <laughs> and I guess one last thing is crockery. Because we have to have our china. Yeah. Um, we use these little mats. We, we stack all of our crockery like that and uh, of course rather than them rattling around and moving around we use these little mats just cut in squares and place on them like that and they don't move you don't hear it and, and of course that's just you know it's just very small very mm. small profile rather than having them maybe stacked like that yes in the, like a rack or something it's more likely to get broken uh, yeah so uh ideal so these little mats here i have no idea what they're called they actually come with herman um but um, yes. yeah, non-slip But that, you can get a great big roll of it for very That's cheap, can't right, yeah. you? So that is our last tip. Probably six tips. But um, Too many tips. Uh, so yeah, that is our list of ideas for uh, saving space have for storage. Have you got any ideas? Oh, that's how a we good can... one. Yeah, do you have any ideas? Maybe you should share them with us. Because you've seen Herman. How share can we them. improve our little Herman space? Not take Zoe? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that would take up a lot of because I I take up so much space. Yeah, but would you have especially so much in that fun? bed? Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, and uh, don't forget if you if you want to if you think this has been a really good video, uh, don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell before uh, so you can get updates on our latest videos, and don't forget to, to watch play, the other watch the playlist which is playing in front. of which is in front of Zoe's face Why is just it always here? in front of my face? Because you're on that side. Uh, yeah, so don't to forget to uh, <laughs> don't forget to take a look at this playlist here for all the other Vanners collaboration videos. Until next time, thank you very much for watching. And goodbye. <laughs> look at you. Oh dear. I think they enjoyed that. I, yeah, it was a good one, that one. You did chat on, oh my goodness. I chatted on. <laughs> Little chatterbox here. <laughs> right, turn off. Right, that's my 20.